Dan? Mm-hmm. What is your surname? Um, my surname would be Sir Dan. <laughs> All right, gang, everybody, welcome to three hours a night. That's all we ask. It's Conway and Whitman, Tim Conway Jr., and Brian Whitman. Nice to see you, dude. Good to see you, buddy. All right, gang, it is Tuesday, and everybody knows what Tuesday is. It is time to stump that monkey. Yeah. Yeah. Hello, hello, hello. Let me clear my things out of the way. Here comes Monkatine. Who's on my shotgun phone? Hey, shotgun Tom Kelly, K Earth 101. You want to see the birds? You can win at 635 at K Earth 101. Oh. <laughs> That's it. By the way, that's what they do on some of those stations. What They started um, a couple of years ago actually giving listeners the actual time they'd give out the prize because they thought that might help. So it's, um, you know, do you want to win $5,000 happening at 713 tonight at K-Earth 101? Yeah, and then people just tune in you know, at 713. Right. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Shotgun Tom Kelly works here this in this uh, facility. And uh, we have not seen his reaction yet to Brian Whitman's impersonation, but we hope to see that. Well, I, that's not really. I'm not. That's not really. An, I guess it is. I'm just doing. I don't do shotgun. But that's just me kind of doing a DJ. Oh, I see. Okay. Hello, do hello. shotgun. Do shotgun. Hello, hello, hello. Remember who was doing that in the uh, in the parking, parking lot? Garage. Yeah, shotgun uh, engaged all of us one Friday evening not too long ago in a full length conversation. We got the extended twelve inch mix version. Of the earwax story. <laughs> I had earwax. It was compacted. I went to the doctor. I said, I can't wait on this line. i got to get on the radio. He said, well, let me bring you in. Hello, hello, hello. And then when Shotgun was describing his difficulty hearing, he would do the old Gary Owen. I'm Gary Owen. Yeah. He'd hello, his hello, hand hello. and put it over his ear. Yeah, he'd cup the, cup yeah. the uh, hand. <laughs> hello, hello. Who's on my Shotgun phone? <laughs> You know what we should do some night? But what a very nice guy, right? Yes. One what of the a nicest great guys. Guy. Yes. On the planet. Yeah. And in this building, you see him. him and you smile. You know? Yes. So he's, he's a pick me up. I give him a hug. You know what we should do? I throw him a hug. We should call um, his listener line. Right. I'll just call like, as a guy to make a request or something. That would be great. Yeah. That's HT. Is Let's he still that. on or is he off at 7? No, no he's I'm off at 10 o'clock. 6 10 to 10. O'clock. Hello, hello. 6 to 10. Okay, Who's that's right. Then Burns phone. goes. All Good right, it's time for Stump the Monkey, ladies and Hi. gentlemen. Malu Dan is with us. He is the monkey. We are the monkey stumpers. And we ask him fairly simple questions. Simple i got to be today. honest with you. I- I'm real tired today. All right. All right. I've spent, I-, I just came from San Diego. All right, Malibu Dan. And I'm tired. You were in San Diego today? I was in San Diego all day today. What'd you do, buddy? Surf? Let's just say that uh, 97 Point Fun and the Conway and Whitman show will be doing something with core off-road racing. There you go. All right, Malibu Dan, what does CSI stand for? Remember the show CSI on CBS? It's my my favorite. What does it stand for? If it's your favorite show, this will roll off the tongue. Yeah, it will. Criminal, right? No. Crime? Yes. Mm -hmm. That's right? Yes. Um, eyes investigation. Okay. Right? Yeah. Right. Criminal investigation. Criminal. Not, not criminal. Crime. Crime. And, CSI. Right, right. Oh, C- hello, hello, uh, hello. Right. Who's CSI. on my shotgun phone? You want to win tickets to see the spinners? 635 tonight on K Earth 101. <laughs> Wait, the S, is it service, criminal service investigation? Yeah, they, they come, they're like a full service. They Swinging bring all their equipment. Swing and a miss. Yeah. Come on, dude. Your favorite show is CSI. I love this show. I told you, I just spent seven hours in a car. I could have flown to New York by the time I left San Diego to get here. All right. Well, you didn't. But CS, but you, but you know, that has no, nothing to do with it, man. It does, because I zone out. Right? He's no, trying to. I know. He's trying to zone, zone out. out. What he's suggesting is that he's... Um, if, you slept, as... if you slept for seven hours before in a very, very comfortable right. sit-and-sleep mattress... That's right. ...and you woke up very refreshed, you still wouldn't know what CSI That's stood right. For. Very fresh and drinking a nice Miller. Right. So don't, why use the uh, I was on the road as an excuse? Well... CSI, what does that stand for? It's a very popular CBS right, I know, show. I, I crime, um, crime investigation, crime service, crime security. No, but uh, crime S, scene. S. Oh, investigation. Ah. That, there we go. All right. Now I got to tell you, what does I CBS love- stand for? Central Broadcasting. Oh. Get along. What, what is it? Swing and CBS? a miss. <laughs> oh, you work for CBS for how right, long? CBS. 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 Was in, isn't it Central Broadcasting Service? It's still not. Mm. Central, what is it? You, haven't, no. you, you're gonna, you could sit here with the C Sa- until right. about, well, for a year. Well, but I was right. It's broadcast, right? Service. Mm. No. Mm. Broadcast what? Mm. It's broadcast. Right. Broadcasting. Uh, CBS. CB, um, God, what is... I, I remember, it's a little bit off the wall, isn't it? It's a, it doesn't make sense what, what C stands CBS. for. CBS. 
But I'm right. I'm right. It doesn't. Yeah, go on, Brian. Dan Rather Raise your hair. The, reporting the, for the CBS Evening News. Now, does that help you at all? Or is no. that just. I saw Dan Rather, by the way, talking about Peter Jennings. Um, Larry King. Last <laughs> night. Really. Yeah, Larry King said, uh, Dan, what would you want to say to Peter? It was like a weird question. Yeah, it is. He odd. actually said to him, Do you want to say goodnight to Peter? Oh, Jesus. Larry, I would say to Peter, well done, friend. <laughs> Dan, rather, CBS Evening News. <laughs> I'm a little Captain uh, Kirk there. Crazy. All right, Danny, CBS, what is, is that? Central stand? Broadcasting. No, it's uh, not Central Broadcasting. How many times do you have to go back oh, there? Oh, I didn't say, you... I said Central before? Yeah, you said it the whole time. When did I say Central before? Every time we've asked you, you said it. So that means I just said it, Right. He's argumentative tonight, Tim. Well, because I'm tired. I've been in 405 traffic. We don't have to yell. We don't have to yell. No, I, I, you're right. You're right. You're right in front of me. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm tired. Right. I've been in. I'm We're, tired. Danny, what does CBS stand for? I work hard. Um, Before you start chasing right. rabbits all over the place. Broadcasting. Is it? it uh, wait, broadcasting. Let's, let's go. We got broadcasting. So let's said, go with. What'd you almost say there? Service. System. No. System. Oh. Right. Oh. So broadcasting system. Mm. So. It, <laughs> Right. <laughs> so broadcasting system. So now I got to go with the C. Okay. Or I, am I wrong with S? No, it's not fairly, system. You're fairly okay. Yeah. System. Or systems. Yeah. You, have, okay. you, have, you have the BS. Because of plural. Plural. You have the BS. Right. But now, now work on the C. But okay, it's not. It's it's not Cox. We know that. Oh, you can, okay. That's not a bad. It's Cox Communication. Oh, okay. <laughs> Tim is very, you know. He's very hey, fidgety listen. with that dumb button. No, you can't right? use that C word, man. But it, is a, but it is a hard C. It's a no, you're abs- absolutely. It's a c- but I was spelling with an X. It's C U. CU Communication Broadcasting Systems? No, CO. CO? I was thinking for a second. Wait a minute. I don't know this then. I want him to. to go. He, was, right. he was on a swearing jet. I was going to get there. All right. Uh, CO. Communication Call. Broadcasting Call. Systems? Call. What's Where, C-O-L? Where's your wife from? Oh, Columbia. That's right. Uh, no, uh, it's not. Columbian Broadcasting uh, Systems. Uh, you should Which, remember. Which, by the way, no, no, I should remember you should that. remember that. that. My, I've been here my, for 12 years. My brother. But still, still it doesn't have. It doesn't make any sense. Where does oh. that name come from? Oh, okay. Columbia right. Square? Columbia right. Square? Is that where it comes Columbian from? Columbia Square. <laughs> See? Exactly. All right. You got we a question, laugh question for the monkey? Silly. Who is George Steinbrenner? Well, isn't he the owner of a team, correct? Yeah. A very big, big, big baseball team. Yes. Here in Los Angeles. Oh, oh swing in a mess. Oh. Do I, did I have to? Could I have stopped at just an owner of a team? You could have. But I didn't. So now do I have to guess the team? Mm-hmm. Brenner. Jewish, by the way. Brenner's got to be a Jewish I man. told you he would go with that. <laughs> right? He was Conway gonna, told me right before He was going to attack uh, him as a, a Jewish guy. Well, he's a Jew. I know, but but please. Okay. Yeah, that's, what he's not, that's not what he's known for. No, right. But a Jew could... He, know, on his business card, it doesn't say George Steinbrenner, Jewish Jew, fellow. Right. Okay. But I, I could tip a hat to a, to a fellow Jew. Who's okay. done well. Who's done very well. Yes. Right. Like owning, a lot of Owning Jews. the... Red Sox. No. New York Yankees. Yeah. I should have known it because most Jews who own big corporations live in New York. All right. Well, I have property at least in New York. See, that is a uh, statement that will come back to haunt you. That's an anti-Semitic statement. I'm Jewish. I could say it. Malibu Dan. Yeah. Uh, Name all the characters on Gilligan's Island. All right. Let me just light the cigarette here. We got a little bit of time. I'll just smoke on this. Um, Well, we got... You've got yourself your uh, Gilligan. Okay. You've got yourself um, the fat guy. <laughs> oh, Gretchen. <laughs> and, oh, Ginger. Ginger, that's her name. Okay. Right? All right, uh, we got Ginger, Ginger and Gilligan. Right? Marianne. Marianne. Professor. Yes. Professor. Ooh. Right. Um, sorry. Um, let me, I may, I may miss, you've I seen the show him. how many times? Uh, you know, I was seven, eight years old. Let me help high. you. Let me help you with the uh, the fat guy. Right. Let me help you. with I the I want to say his name's John. It's Gilligan, the skipper too. All right. That's right. The millionaire <laughs> and his wife. All right, but but who is the millionaire? Oh, Compton, or uh, <laughs> was it all right? Was he cocky? <laughs> um, Howard, Howie, wasn't it Howard something? <laughs> Call him Howard. Right, Howie. was it? Like yeah. Howard Johnson or something? Like yeah, that? it was <laughs> Howard Johnson. Howard Johnson. Right. Yeah. But he had a real snuffy first name, right? Yes, uh, he did. Yes, right? Thurston. 
Thurston Howell. Yeah. Uh, Thurston Howell the third. And Lovey. And Lovey. Right. Lovey. That's right. Which, by the way, I, I didn't see the all TV right. Congratulations. show. Congratulations. But I heard it was. You got them all. Okay. In what state is the Kennedy Space Center? Uh, was that uh, is that DC? Is it Washington? No. That's not Washington DC, not a state. Well, right, but it's, I know it's a district of Columbia. Oh, sure it is. But is that where it is? No. no. Maryland? No. You're being facetious, and I don't like it. But why would they? Why would they blast a rocket off in a very pop, densely populated area like Washington? Well, DC? you know what? Why even go to the moon anyway, Tim? You could ask tons is of questions. Is it like right out in front of the White House? They blast this thing off? Well. It's a, well <laughs> I guess not. Yeah, the president spends the night in a hotel so they can it's keep Florida, away from Florida. The- oh, yes. Oh, all right. That's all right. Okay. Malibu Dan, where Thank is, you. Where is the new Disney Hall? Uh, downtown L.A. That's correct, and sir. And it's, it's outstanding. That's correct, sir. Props to D-Land. You got uh, the, the monkey. The acoustics are unbelievable. <laughs> the acoustics in there are unbelievable. I'd love to go watch jazz. <laughs> How are you? How are you? All right. For which network did Peter Jennings work? Uh, that would be NBC. Oh, That's wrong. ABC. God. That's oh. right. Oh, CBS. Oh, just kidding. ABC. All right. All right. What was his job over at? He ABC? was. He was the um, not, I, well, a reporter. I guess you could. He no. was a reporter. He was anchor. There you go. Yeah, but he was a reporter too. All right, Melody. What and is he's Canadian, by the way? Yes. What yeah. is a uh, yeah, that's what is right. a Coke can made out of? <laughs> Aluminum. What is it? Aluminum. Uh, what? Aluminum. Aluminum. That's correct. Aluminum. Sir. All right. Of the two, of, <laughs> monkey. Of the two most recent countries we've Ooh. invaded, Iraq is one. And Iran? No. Uh, um, Sudan? No. Jordan? No. <laughs> Israel? No. After nine uh, eleven, we oh, hit. Oh, where we? Where'd we go? We hit the Taliban pretty hard. Is it Quebec? No. Kuwait? Quebec. Quebec. Yes. Yeah, awesome. Quebec. Hot. Yeah. Great. Uh, the uh, Taliban was was just outside wait, 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 of uh, Montreal. You know, look at you know. So I believe, uh, you know, I believe uh, that the presence of the Taliban in Quebec <laughs> presents kind of a danger for America. <laughs> yeah, it's so close. Hey, look, you know, it's right up, you know, right up, right north of the border, and I believe we got to stand firm. <laughs> All right, Danny. Yeah. What was the question? Where again? was the Taliban uh, hanging out? And we we bombed this country and destroyed. Well, them we after. said Iraq. That's not correct. Baghdad. No. No, here's the question, Dan. Yeah, thank you. Listen, thank listen. you. That's all I needed. Of the two most recent countries we've invaded, right. Iraq is one. That's right. I said Name that. Name the other. It's not, it's not, it's not Saudi Arabia. It's not the Saudis, right? No, we it's like not. The, we get along with the Saudis. That's right. The Saudis are our eternal friends. I, I like to have uh, Prince Abdullah down the ranch in Crawford. <laughs> you know, so... <laughs> You know, you know, he's a Laura and I. You know, you know, Laura and I count him a good friend. <laughs> hey, uh, Jay Leno had a great joke the other night. Uh, the uh, the king of Saudi Arabia died. They went to bury him, and while they were digging the grave, they struck oil. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, look, I appreciate that. You know, so, look, you know, I appreciate it. I, I appreciate Jay Leno's humor. <laughs> All right, come on, Malibu. All right, monkey. I'm having a good time listening to you guys. This All right, is where is talk. it? It's right next to Pakistan. Um, Palestine. <laughs> Palestine. <laughs> How's that sound? Palestine. How about this? Well, pa- it is Pakistan. If it doesn't, right? if it doesn't come before, it comes after. Af. It's tur. Af. Af. Afghanistan. Yes, sir. Hey. hey, hey, hey. Right, it was on the tip of the tongue the entire time. What I is was just so in- Malibu in Dan? Uh, Malibu Dan is the monkey, folks, and you can stump him at 520-9710. Can That's, I pitch it? Yeah, pitch it as, uh, as a- Sam as Rubin. Boy? Okay. <clears throat> I've got ears for good music. The kids these days listen to rap, Britney Spears, Jessica Simpson. What about the Smokey Robinsons and other good bands that we all grew up with? My target. Do you want to stump the monkey? 520-9710. Or call from your Sprint PCS phone. Pound 971. How long are you on the 405 for? Seven hours. Wow. Is it oh, worth it? it was All I, right, I, all right was monkey, horrible. what does CPK um, stand for? CPK? Yes, sir. The CPK. Why well, no DCP? DCK's Dick CPAC. Oh, that's interesting. Interesting. What does CPK stand for? CPK. Yeah. <laughs> CPK. I have no. Like, I always like Kentucky something. Kentucky with a C. Yeah. Kentucky Fried Chicken. But uh, but CPK. Are you are you messing up? Do you mean KFC? 
No. He means CPK, oddly. Well, right? what does KFC stand for? Kentucky Fried Chicken. Okay, now what does, K- what does CPK stand for? Well, does it have anything to, to do with Kentucky Fried Chicken? No, but it has to do with food. It does? Yeah. CPK. Yeah. Are, are you, uh, what's it's up, a, Brian? What's up? It's a it's restaurant. A, yeah, you live in Southern California, right? Right. But no, I know I love you've it. Gr- you've grown up here. You, you, you're a native. But right, but I don't eat. If you could tell by my body, I don't eat a lot of. Fast well, but, food. I, but, is, but there's a lot of restaurants I don't eat at, but I see them. So CPK is a fast food joint. No, no, but it's a restaurant. It's a restaurant. Yeah. Oh my God. Uh, <laughs> no, no, wait, 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 no, no, a no, California no, pizza no, kitchen. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's what it is. Just because I. I I don't know the acronym for a food joint. What's no. DNB? What's DNB? By the way, acronym? Good word. Thank acronym. You. Hey, Thank you. Danny. What's DNB? DNB. Is... Give me DNB. DNB. Uh, uh, Dave and Busters. Dave and Busters. Uh, what's and what's the uh, what's the the uh... I forgot it. All right. All right. All right. You, All right. Got, you got the monkey. Yeah. That, was, that wasn't fair though. It was pretty CPK. fair. People don't go. I'm going to CPK. Oh, they sure do. I, I, most more people say Who? CPK than California Pizza Kitchen. More people smoke pot than drink beer. <laughs> All right. Five two. Oh. <laughs> Who was known as Honest Abe? Abraham Lincoln. That's correct, sir. That's right. right. Uh, Couldn't tell a lie, that guy. Malibu Dan. What school is last year and the previous year's national championship or national champion in college football? That would be USC. That's correct, sir. Yeah, go Trojans. Going for three in a row. (laughs) Yeah. They're going to kick some ass. Yeah. Yeah. And I think. This would be three in a row, three correct responses in a row, wouldn't it? I, I think so. <laughs> yeah. You're going for the hat trick. Let's do it. All right. Oh, uh, that just jinxed what me. What I hear, uh, Shotgun Tom Kelly, who's producing our show, so we get some good callers. Hello, hello. He who's said, on my shotgun phone? Liz, you're on our shotgun phone. How are you? I'm good. Thank you. You got a question for the monk? What's a you? Yes. What does ER mean? ER, ER. mean emergency room. That's correct, Aww. sir. Hot. Hot. That's okay. What uh, does okay. what does the S in NASA stand for? Is it? Um, hmm, that's a great question. That Matter of fact, you could throw tongue. in you could throw in the N and the A and the other A and <laughs> S should be easy though. That's how you. Is, is it space? Hmm. Yeah. Let's talk to uh, uh, Gristav. Is it Gristava? Is that right? Is that uh, how yeah, you pronounce that name? Gristava. Hey, Gristava. How are you? Good. All right. You, you, you got a question for the monk? Uh, what is the for? Where? SUV. Wait, what's this? Wait, 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 what's yeah, what's what? a question? Are you alive? She's got I'm a bad alive. phone. What, what's a question? Repeat the question. Gustava, you are no longer allowed to call this radio station. Ever, 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 ever again. You are, you are a, a retard. Yes. I mean, she was a real retard. A retard. <laughs> Uh, I think she uh, she was trying to ask what SUV stands yeah, for. You know yeah. that. That you know. Yeah, um, let's see. All-terrain vehicle. Uh, uh, I thought you knew more about cars than anybody else. I, I do. I, t- I was on the freeway for seven years. You seven probably hours. saw about 100 SUVs right. an hour. I right. probably more than that. No, yeah. I did. Oh, absolutely. Well, I know it's it's all-terrain all vehicle. Uh, no. what, it, the S and the, the U and the V? You don't know uh, what SUV stands for? I know what it is. Uh, Give me a second, for God's sakes. Again, I've been uh, on the 405 for seven hours. But cars are your passion. Well, that's true. That's true. Brian has an SUV, should, doesn't he? Yes. yes, he does. He has... What kind does he have? A Chevy Suburban. Yeah. A very, very nice one. I got a yeah. DVD player there. You know what I have in Do you have there? a DVD player in there? I do. And a full tank of gas. <laughs> yeah, we'll get to that next hour on 97.1. What's it cost? 80 bucks to fill that thing up? We'll get there next hour. <laughs> Danny, what is, it, what is an SUV? Uh, what is it? A... Um, V- okay, V is vehicle, right? Okay. Mm. And U is not, all- oh, I guess all terrain, I guess wouldn't work out, right? That'd be UTV. Right, that'd be UTV. All terrain? Right. Or all terrain? A-L-T? All would a- be with an A. That's right. See, that's what I'm saying. Right, an S-A-B. So we agree, so we agree, okay? We agree that you don't know the answer. All-terrain. That one that we agree all-terrain. on that, absolutely. Really, really bad about all terrain vehicle. <laughs> Oh, come on, Dave. Is that your Meryl Schindler impression? <laughs> I'm Schindler. <laughs> I'm some point wanting to get a I want the Yang Chow in Woodland Hills. <laughs> I had some unbelievable spicy wontons. <laughs> All right. Uh, vehicle. What's U- something? V. S- sport. Oh, yes. Right. Sport. Yes. Um, yes. Sport. Sport. You. 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 What, what, do, what do you pay you. when you pay your electric bill? You're paying your blank bill. My, you're paying for your electric, your water. Those are your, your electricity. Well, oh. It begins with a U. You pile them all up. My, my your monthly. 
Mm. Right, my monthly nut. Four, sil- four syllables. Four syllables. It's four syllables. Mm. The U is four syllables. Right. That's a lot of. Well, that's un- what your, your bills are. No. Right. Sports. Sports. Sport. Vehicle. Sport. Sports. Sport. Singular. Sport. <laughs> right. Sport. 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 <laughs> U vehicle. And then okay. I got maybe you is really just meant to be the you. <laughs> just on it. Right. It, it lives alone. He's cute. I gotta give like, my, why, why is Essie? Uh, <laughs> like, why does I, I, I give Dan a hug? It lives on its own. On my new car, I have an SEL. But why? But why does the E could be just thrown in there? Huh? Yeah, but usually they stand for something. Mm. But SUV but, is a category of vehicle, as you know. Sport, sport, utility vehicle. Hey! hey. Oh. Yeah. Someone at, door. Someone at the door. Someone at the door. Mark and Teen. Who the? Hey, great question. All right, Give let's him a talk to uh, Pablo in L.A. You're on 97.1. You got a question for the monk? <laughs> yeah, man. Hey, I'm in an SUV right now as it is, Good man. for you. Yeah, what kind? I, I, I got a question for you, Malibu. What That's does great. IRS stand for? Internal Revenue Service. Hey, Mark and Teen. Come on now. You're on fire, dude. I feel hotter than hell, literally. I'm hotter than hell. The AC does not work in this place. Ashraf. In L.A., you're on 97.1. How are you? Affleck. Good. How are you? All right, Affleck. Good. All right. What does uh, CPA stand for? Uh, California Pizza <laughs> Association. Association. <laughs> no, CPA. global positioning. Nah, CPA. Oh, CPA. I thought you, say, I thought you said GPA. You, you, when you, you, your, uh, your guy does your taxes, no, your I, CPA. He, CPA is a totally different thing. I thought he Don't said, you have a CPA that does your taxes? Uh, yes, I do, too. What is that guy? Um, he is my accountant, if you must Okay, know. that's the A. That's, that's right. A. right. Uh, he's personal, would be P, right? Nah. He serves the public. Yes. That's right, public. And he has a uh, a plaque on the wall, so he is? A stud. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. A studly old, public accountant. Very old nuts. <laughs> he loves it. Nah, he is. Uh, he, he has a certificate. On the, oh, he yes. Is. Public yeah. accountant. CPA. Yeah. Now, did you know what that Baby stood steps. for? No, you did not. We helped, but you, you helped. figured it out. Thanks. Well, I could have if I would have if I didn't have all the tension on me. It's hot. I've been in the car for seven hours. Ralph and, and Westlake, you're on the air. Yeah, hey, monkey. Uh, the green light on a stoplight. What uh, what position is that? Hmm. The green light on a stoplight. Yeah, middle, top, or bottom. Uh, that's actually a really good question. <laughs> <laughs> oh Jesus! I think it's a uh, bottom. Yeah. yeah. But think about that. You you know you had to think about it a little bit. You, in your mind, you no, said, okay, red. You, you didn't know right away. Sure you did. Yeah, what color is the stop it, sign? It climbs. Red. But it, you thought about it. What color is the writing on the stop sign? White. Yes. All right, Ian in Los Angeles, you're on the air. Don't think of a pink hey, elephant. Hey, dude. Hey, remember me? Uh, oh, it's Ian. I don't remember That's Ian. 16 year old Ian. Old guy oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Now, Ian, we were talking about you just the other day. Really? On the air? Yeah, you're the guy looking for the job, right? Yeah. Job hunt not going so good. Oh, no. see, okay, so we're going to ha- set this up. We're going to do the uh, Conway and Whitman employment line. Right. All right. Here's my question for okay. Monkey. What does CSUN stand for? Oh, CSUN. Great question, Ian. Uh, CSUN's, uh, it's it's the Long Beach, right? No. Mm. Isn't CSUN, what's California mm. State University? Ooh. Mm. Right? And where is it? Northridge. Whoa! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> In your face, dude. Oh, in your boy. face. Hey, Ian. Yeah. yeah Hold on one face. second. Uh, Malibu Dan will get you. You have his information? Yeah, I have his number. Yeah, okay. yeah you're coming right, in, buddy. Ian. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll see if we can I'll hook call you up. You guys I'm not going to pick him up, by the way. That was the controversy <laughs> last time. I'm not going to pick him up. We're going to we send a car. The street squad will get him or something. Whatever you want to do. You know, he, he'll make his way in. Right. All right. We, uh, can, we can pick him up. Well, he's 16. We do want to make sure that he has safe transportation. You can take the bus. Yeah, but then all of a sudden you pick him up and there's a car wreck. and Yeah, he'll make it in. Okay, yeah, I'm, just, I'm just trying to help. <laughs> I'm just trying to help Tim, you know. Yeah, he's here. got parents, right? Yeah. Hey, listen, you know what? If he's going to have a job, he's got to get to the job, right? Well, that's true. That's yeah. a very good point, Tim. So, very good point. Really, uh, he's oh. got to, okay. He'll find his way He's got to step up. Fine. Fine. All right, Maladam, what does ASAP stand for? As soon as possible. That is correct, sir. Yeah. Name. This is the longest segment of my life. Oh, Name. You've got another 10 minutes. Left. Oh, Jesus. Name. God. <laughs> we do. Yes. Name. Name. Two Beatles songs. Oh, wow. Wow, wow. Uh, was it Hey Jude? Uh, that's one. Uh, but you know how I like to call And Hey Jude, the uh, dance version? I like Hey Jude. And then also, um, isn't it 
Isn't hello again? Hello. That's actually Lionel Richie. <laughs> Just called to say. No, hello. that's Neil Diamond. Neil Diamond. I think about you every night. night. Although I know, I know it's, it's late. late. That's Stevie Wonder. But I couldn't wait. <laughs> I just Hello. called to say I loved you. Yeah, I love you. You know All what right. I like? I like this. Yeah. LA's fine. The sunshine's most oh, that's of the time. <laughs> that's a good song. When I hear that, it's lighter out, waving it in the air. Yes. I, I, I love and the feeling is Neil Diamond. Back. Two Beatles songs, my love. Okay, okay, I said, hey, Jude, and... Um, Rinse a little, but you know. Yellow Submarine. Oh. That's good. Yeah, that's not too shabby, huh? Yeah. Has this ever happened to you? Have you ever, honest guy, on my way into work over the seven hours of driving here on the 405 freeway, I was playing DJ Quick, Fandango, which Brian told me yesterday he loves the song, Do Louder the Than a Mother Effer. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I look to the left of me, the hottest chick in a convertible looks over to me and is laughing at me. Right. Because I'm this okay. white guy listening there to are, DJ there Quick. There are some more people in the car tonight doing the same thing. Believe me, there are a lot of white Jewish guys doing the Fandango. <laughs> yeah, All right, right Malibu Dan, where is, where is Wrigley Field? Don't do the that would be in Boston. That is wrong, sir. Sorry. Swing and a Wrigley. miss. Is San Francisco? That's wrong. Ooh. New York. That's oh, wrong. Three strikes. Wrigley? Yeah. Didn't we visit Wrigley Field? No. Didn't we go to Wrigley Field when we went In to Boston? Boston? No. You what did I get to... thrown out of? No. The radio station. No, I got thrown out of a track, a horse track, a dog track. No, it, it, wasn't, uh, it wasn't Wrigley Field. Was it Wrigley Field? No. Who plays at Wrigley Field? Mm. Well, well that that's, gives it away. Well, yeah. Maybe not. The Dodgers play there sometimes. Well, no, Wrigley Field's not in California. That's Uh, correct. That is right. uh, Right. Come on, Brian. That's right. Don't get confused. That narrows it it down, right? And it's not in Florida. Right. Where the Kennedy Space Center is. That's right. We learned Um, that tonight. Now you have a 1 in 25, no, 1 in 48 chance. Chance. Yeah, being that there's 50 states, I've eliminated two. Well, you can eliminate Hawaii and Alaska. That's that's four. And you know what? I wouldn't think states. Right. I'd think city. City. Chicago? Yeah. Yeah. Right on. Chicago. Right on. That feels great. All right. uh, You you have the monkey. Where are, where are, I'm very fortunate. (laughs) Let me ask it this way. The UN is an important international organization. What does UN stand for? United Nations. That's correct. And where are they headquartered? Man, uh, Washington, D.C. Swing and a miss. Um, The UN building. Can we left it just at that, Brian, maybe? Now, where is the UN? New York. That's correct. Yeah. All right, Malibu Dan. There are new changes this year in Monday Night Football. Oh. What's the big one? <laughs> There's a big change in Monday Night Football this year. Does it have to do with salary cap at all? No. <laughs> the, big cha- the big change in Monday Night Football, they're playing baseball. Yes. <laughs> they're not calling it football, it's they're calling it soccer? It's a huge change this year, Monday Night well, Football. Well, let me ask you, does it have to do with the rules? No. Does it have to do with, do it, do with locations of a team? No. Does it have to do with owners? No. Does it have to do with flag football at all? No. <laughs> what about fag football at all? No. No. Does it have to do with? Um, I said it doesn't have to do with rules. No, it does not. It doesn't. Obviously, it doesn't involve Los Angeles. Right. Right. So we're not getting a team that's. It has to the, do with with television. They're switching from CBS to NBC. No. CBS to. to Wait, what were they on for years? ABC. Okay. okay. That's where Peter Jennings was. And they're Jennings going to CBS. No. no. They're going to Fox. No. Mm. UPN. No. Fox Television. <laughs> no. It's not going to be on ABC this year. But where's it going to be? It's going to be on a, on a, another station. What station do you think it's going to be on? Well, if it's, it has to be one of the big players, right? It has it, to be either Fox. No, it's not Fox. At CBS? No. Nope. NBC? No. ABC? No. Mm. But wait a minute. That's the four big players. It's not going to be on one of those stations. So it's not on TV? It's going to be on a cable station. You're kidding me. No. So if you don't have cable, you can't watch football? Bingo. It's an, it's an outrage, isn't it? Actually, it is pretty pathetic if you think about it. There's a lot of people who don't have cable. <laughs> That's right. True. Take a stand, it's horrible. monkey. That's right. Take a stand. And I, I, I won't have it. Matter of fact, I don't want to guess it. All right. Because you're offended. What What? What I is the most likely for, network for MSNBC. No. Bumbo. Because <laughs> when they don't have Rita Cosby and Chris Matthews. Well, what's going on with you? And Dan Abrams, the Abrams Report. I, I mean, What's I, the most likely station for... Fox Sports West. Well, that's a good answer. That's not a bad answer. Right? Spike TV. But, but what's the big network? Comedy Central. Ah, you're, you're out of your Nickelodeon. mind. Now you're just... 
Al Rentel, tell them how crazy Look, he is. Look, you know, you're just spouting out, spouting out <laughs> answers, and they're all wrong, they're all bad. But, you know, you don't even want to listen to the question. <laughs> He's you a know, liberal. So, well, Let's be a liberal. liberal. That's right. Do yourself a favor. Take a deep breath. All right? And let's him right. ask the question, all right. All right. and then go ahead and answer it. Right. But, you know, if you want to be like one of these Sacramento liberals running around raising taxes and trying to, you know, extend freedom to child molesters, <laughs> and that's what they do. You know, they don't think pedophiles should be in prison. They don't think pedophiles should be watching uh, Monday no, Night Football. No, they don't. So let him ask the question, dum-dum, and then I, right. heard him, Mal- I, heard him, I actually heard Al one night call a caller. Quote, Mr. Dum Dum. <laughs> that was great. He said, Oh, what do you think about that, Mr. Dum Dum? Oh, that's awesome. You know what? I um, What's the big sports network on cable? I said Fox Sports oh, West, Fox Sports Net, Fox Sports. It's well, been well, around for a long time. Yeah. But they uh, they all have been around for a long How time. How about this? Let me give you a hint. By you now. put blinders on? ABC well, owns it. ABC thought, well, let's take Monday Night Football off of Channel 7, That's ABC right. Network and Television. And put them on Channel 13. And put it on our cable station that does sports. Which is a stupid idea. But all the right. network is? So it's owned by, by Disney. Four letters. Yes. Four letters. Yes. Four letters. For the network. MSNB. That's five. It's not HGTV. It's not, it's not Home Garden Television. CNN. What is the most likely Oxygen station? Channel? OLN. The NHN. The, no, it's not, it's not the no, Natalie the, Holloway Network. It's not the Home. Uh, what is the most obvious network? That, right. That, oh, ESPN. Uh, hey. Please. Come on. By the way, I love ESPN. I love their radio station. But, but I can't you just said it was a bad move. It's a hor- Well, it's a great move for them. But don't you think that's a bad move for I think, viewers? I think it's a lot of people are going to miss it. I think ABC and Monday Night Football is a is, when people grow up, or when they were growing up, when I was growing up, yep. and uh, when you were growing up, Brian, is every Monday night you look forward to ABC right. and Monday Night Football. That's yeah. right. Yeah, it's not going to be on Monday. night. All my rowdy friends are here on Monday night. Yes, that's right. when the Raiders and the Broncos are coming over tonight. Yeah, right. Hank Williams, baby. <laughs> All right, Moncatine. Yes, just him. Uh, real quickly, when Please. they when they speak of South Beach, where are they talking Florida. about? Okay. All right, we got to take a break. Yeah, when we come back. More Chicken Stump dinner. the Monkey. 520-9710. Sprint PCS Pound 971. <laughs> it is the Conway and Whitman Show. Tim Conway Jr. and Brian Whitman live at 97.1 yeah, FM Talk Station. All right, it's uh, Conway and Women on 97.1 <laughs> FM Talk Station. Oh, Tim and I mix it up you a little bit. You went off. I hold you guys back. Beat down my uh, partner here for gas. Blaming gas prices on the wrong people. Uh-oh. All right, we're in the middle of Stomp the Get Monkey him, here. Get him. I know you want to. Stomp the Monkey. When you and I go to KABC, because I have some contacts over there, when you and I go over there to KABC to do the hot news and the burning issues, we'll debate things like gas prices and OPEC exactly. and all of that. You mean exactly I can't right. fart over there? For right now, we'll, uh, we'll go to strip bars and, <laughs> and uh, fart on mics <laughs> <laughs> and try to avoid having our pictures taken. Right. All right, gang. It's Stump the Monkey, 520-9710. You ask the monkey a simple question, and his answers are most likely going to be entertaining. Oh, That's thanks, basically Tim. the deal. Thanks a Dan bunch. Dan in San Bernardino, you're on the air. Yeah, um, I'll uh, ask the monkey uh, how many days are in leap year. Uh, hmm. That would be 366 days. That's correct, dude. Oh. Man. Look at you, man. Yeah, yeah. Was that entertaining enough for you? Yeah, it was you not stud? that entertaining. We would like for you to stammer around with like <laughs> 700, 900, 8,000, and then get to 360. Now, I, I got that hard, and it comes once every four years. All right. Let's I have a friend that's only 12 years old because of leap, leap year. What is leap day? That would be February 29th. That's correct. Patrice in Buena Park, you're on 97.1. MIA. What? Huh? Hey. Hello? On? M-I-A. Ah? Uh, Air? A? <laughs> Honey B? Oh? Computer? M-I-A? Patrice? Uh-huh. Do you know how to properly ask a question? Right. No. M-I-A. Let me help you out. <laughs> yeah. All right? Yeah. When when I when we pick up the phone again, we uh-huh. say, hey, Patrice, go, hey, guys, you know, <laughs> love the show. If you notice, Patrice has <laughs> problems with more than three syllables at a time. Yeah, yeah but you no, know what? This is why they- You just did three. <laughs> but this is why McDonald's no. and uh, Burger King and all these okay, fast food no. places, this is why they design the menu That's right. for people like this. You know, they walk in, uh, one, uh, four, 
And that's, you know, that's a communication that you have now with the guy at the counter at McDonald's. This should be television because the, the, the look, look is so funny. Well, it's it's so the guy funny. looking up at the board, <laughs> you know, scanning the sandwiches that he's seen a million times. But I love, I love, I say to Patrice, Patrice has problems with stringing together more than three <laughs> syllables at a time. Her response, no, I don't. Right, three syllables. It's unbelievable. All right, Patrice, what is your question for Malibu Dan? Okay, what does MIA mean? Hey, well, that's actually not even not correctly asked either. <laughs> right. Are you what? talking about missing in action? It, it, yeah. you, what is does it what mean, it or what, is, what does it stand for? Hmm? Yeah, what does it stand for? Right. Whatever. You, do you guys just enjoy picking on people? No, nah, Patrice, you got to be part of the you know the of, of human beings. You, you deserved be able it, to Patrice. Communicate. You deserved it. She deserved it. All right, Patrice, we thank she you for calling. It. MIA, ah, you got to be able to communicate. Well, yeah. yeah, I mean, I mean, you pick up the phone. MIA, right? Uh O U A. Right. Flower. Now, what does Flower. MIA stand for? Missing in action. That is correct, sir. The, thank you, Tim. Who was Thanks, the Tim. Who was the Democratic nominee for president last year? Mm. Uh, you voted for him. Yeah. Um. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> who did I vote for? Who was it? Was it Gore? It was right around when was you. It Gore? No, nah, it was, was, it was it right Gore? around when they were looking at you for the morning job at KBC. Oh, and then right, they that's right. That's right. And they, because they're, they, I, the interview went swimmingly until yeah. the last question. They're nice people, aren't they? They're very nice over there. What was the? Uh, what's the response very to nice. that question? Well, um, who was the Democratic nominee? He ran. He ran against George W. Bush. <laughs> right, right, right. You know, so you know, I, you know, I appreciate it. Who ran against Bush last time? I'm just trying to th- hold on one second. It was a, a year ago, November. Well, exactly. I can't even remember tomorrow or yesterday. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Do you think anyone's going to use those pennies on there? <laughs> That's what, it's, I can't I remember tomorrow. No, but where's my 80 cents? You took that? No, you got, you got your M&Ms. Danny, who ran against George W. Bush? <laughs> your M&M. You have to shout, Dan. Sorry. Danny. Um, Monkey? <clears throat> give me, give me, no, don't give me anything. Come just on. give me a second. Just give me a second. It was a year ago. It was nine months ago. Exactly. He, he was, and it's a long time. I can't even remember a month every ago. Every single day he was in the papers on TV. I he know, was the big I guy. Know. He got more votes than anybody in the history of politics except they for really George liked w. Him Bush. really liked him a lot. They liked him a lot. We liked him. We did like him, right? He had a he, yes. We, uh, we did. I did. Right. You voted for him. Brian voted for yes, him. Yes, I felt he was. Give, give me, I think give me, Insulaco voted for him. Too. Insulaco voted I'm for sure him. Give me did. the last letter of the first. No, come, come on. on. No. You should know. Was this. he a governor? It, it should roll off oh. the tongue. Was he a governor? No, he was a senator. Was he, was he, he was a senator. senator from Massachusetts? Was it McCain? Kerry? No, get Kerry? out of here. Kerry. It was John Kerry. John Kerry. Yes, that's right. Your uncle, Mr. Dan Dalton, did an amazing song. Yes, what a great John Kerry song. That's right. It's a toe tap. How can I forget about that? Not right. as timely like as it Curry. used to be. That's All right. right. Do you got a question for the Monkey team? I sure do. Yeah. Oh, you mm. just asked him one. Let me give him one. All right. Okay. All right. Uh, Malibu Dan, name two NHL players, past or present. Luke Robitaille. That's one. And Scooty McGee. <laughs> <laughs> no Scooty McGee. <laughs> Scooty. No, no Luke Robitaille passing over to Scooty McGee. Scooty shoots. Remember when Scooty! Scooty! <laughs> I talked to I said to Conway. We went to go to a Kings game. Hey Tim, why are they all booing Luke? It's like a Luke. Yeah, they're actually saying his name. All right, right. I'm out with him. Um, okay. Uh, well, Bob Miller. No, he played. He no, he did not. He never played. He's no. the announcer. Right? No, I know. But to be an announcer, do you have to play? No. I like that guy. By the way, good guy. And NHL, NHL are they're coming back? Yes, they are. That's exciting, right? It's great. Yeah, I'm excited. It's going to really improve my life. I was very depressed without the NHL. No, it is great to have that. It's a great sport. It's a fun sport to watch. It's the best. It's actually it is the best. It's, it's, I like it. I much prefer to see hockey in person than on yeah, TV. It's yeah. great. And, and yeah. by the way, this is something you should go to, but they do Fury on uh, Frozen Fury. Cool. And what it is, is the Kings will play, I think this year it's Colorado, and they play at the MGM Grand. So you stay at the MGM Grand, you go down, and they play in the arena, and then you can gamble and drink, and it's the it's the best. It's it's mid-September when they do this. Oh. So it's soon. I've Her- been to it three or four times, and you you stay in a hotel, go down and watch a Kings game, and then you can gamble and drink in the same facility. There's nothing like it. Seriously, that's right around the time your dad and Harvey Corman are going to be at the Stardust. Yes. So we'll let's have go to, do we'll that. Have to look when, at that. When is the first uh, game? In, NHL game? In, I think in October. Yeah. But let's get back to the question that was asked. Wayne Gresky. Yes, sir. All right. That is Thank correct. you. Luke Robitaille and Wayne Gretzky. Okay. Oh, let's go, we zip through some calls here. Barbara and San Pedro, you're on the air. Hi. Hi, guys. Hey. Hi, Barbara. Oh, oh that's sweet. That's nice, baby. <laughs> mm-hmm. sweet. Um, 
Yeah. My question is, what does UPS stand for? United Postal Service. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. What? Got it. Yeah. No, he yeah. did not. No, he did not. Yeah. I did it? No, no, he did not get it. UPS, uh, Barbara, newsflash for you, too, there, darling. <laughs> <laughs> it's not United Postal Service. No, it's not. No, it's parcel service. Oh, parcel. no, you're not supposed to give it to him, Barbara. <laughs> You don't understand the rules. What does USPS stand for? USPS? Right. United States Parcel Service? Oh, Babu, you mixed it up. Postal Service? Yes, sir. All right. Okay. All right. What does a stamp cost? Are you uh, just? Uh, is just you and me? Did, can Tim get a question no, in? Because his questions are easier questions than in. yours. Right, it, how much is a stamp? Thirty-seven qu- cents. That's correct. <laughs> Joel, Joel in downtown LA. You're on with the monkey. How you guys doing? All right, dude. Uh, what is what is the PCH? What is it? Yeah, what does yeah. it stand for? Well, uh, PC, Pacific way, Coast Highway. By the way, stamps, Retards, are, stamps huh? are 39 cents. No, they're not. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't stamps 39 cents? <laughs> Have you been paying 39 cents for yourself? Somebody I? has somebody else doing their postal work. Why am I suddenly embarrassed? <laughs> Come on, aren't stamps 39 cents? No. No. 37. No. 37. Right. They no. went from 35 to 37. How much, is a, right. po- how much is a postcard? Like 17 cents? I don't know. Can I get a bulk I don't send many postcards no, to people. me neither. Not with email now. Yeah. All right, Malibu Dan. Yeah. The question. I said Pacific Coast Highway. That's correct, sir. Uh, PA, PA, how are you? Hey, I'm fine. All doing. right. Conway, Whitman. I want to stump the monkey. You got it, evening. baby. Are you a black lady? Yes, hey. I am. Okay. I'm a, hey. okay. a lady Good. of color. There you okay, go. whatever. All right, you got a question for this? It's okay. Uh, You're racist, man. No, I just want to know who I'm talking to. <laughs> yes. Um, go on. My question is, first of all, I want to say love your show. Oh, oh man, you're Endless the best, baby. Talk show. Talk show is the best. Oh, well, okay. you're the best. You're the best. Oh, yeah. you, are, you are no, Pierre. You are number one. Oh, we got two seconds here. What's the question? <laughs> What's okay, the question is, I want to know what city Hollywood Park is located in. Oh, great question, man. Thank is you. It... Thank you. Thank you. Well, I know it's not Hollywood. Have you been to Hollywood Park? Well, you know what? I got to tell you, I'm sort of embarrassed by it. I always... You've been to Hollywood Park, right, Danny? I have. You've taken him, I'm sure. Yeah. No, he's taken, he's taken me a few times. Matter of fact, I went back <laughs> and asked for my money back because of Tim. <laughs> Is it Inglewood? Yeah! Yeah! Inglewood! All right! Yeah! Right. Big boy in the moon! Uh, you t- and- hey, wait, hold him a second. Pa- PA? Yeah, PA. Does that say for We're going to send Prince you Arthur? something here. We're going to send okay. you a, uh, a pair of tickets to the uh, Gypsy Kings this yeah. Sunday. Yeah. Oh, thank yeah, you. Yeah, it's going to be great. You, you get your groove on. Take, take your boyfriend or girlfriend. What do you get? And get, get your drink on. Yeah, G. This get Sunday your, night at the Greek Theater. On. For more information, go to greektheaterla.com. Yeah. Get your swerve on. Yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Now, what, what is the uh, Gypsy Kings? Yeah. Have you seen it? Yeah. Uh, no, the Gypsy Kings, uh, they're number five on the countdown this weekend. Is that right? No. I don't they're know. an old school band. They're old, old school. school. But okay. you're, you're right. she, PA. All right, we got to get out of here. We got to take oh, a break. When we come back, yes, <laughs> Monkey, we're Thank done you. with you, buddy. Thank you. It's Conway Thank and Women live on 97.1 Different Talk Station.